So hello everybody, and yeah, we are back, and I really need to change my fusion core before it disappears on me. Um, we uh, did our 24 hour shopping with the Brotherhood. Love that place. Tegan just seems to, I, I don't know. He just never sleeps. The shop's open 24 seven, it's brilliant. So, <laughs> went and got rid of a load of stuff, uh, sold like uh, drugs to Cade and all the rest. So just jumped off the side of the Pridwin. And now we're debating what to do. Norgalem Beach has got a kidnapping case. The problem is the minute you activate a kidnapping case, okay, it has to be done there and then. Unlike other ones where they turn around and say to you, oh well, uh, these readers are giving us some trouble, can you take care of it? You can take your time about getting around to it. Kidnapping case, the minute they turn around and say to you, this person has been kidnapped, you have to go and deal with it. Okay? So, at the minute, I am going to the castle. They've got slightly a little bit more happier. I built them a couple of shops and everything, because that's where we left off. I built a couple of shops, and I've left one person free, because I'm going to need someone to run a trade route for me. Um, I can pull people for trade routes from other places as well. I'm actually going to have to go to Sunshine Tiding and pull the recruitment beacon from there as well, because it is supposed to be like a railroad hideout as well. So we're going to have to go there. But what we are doing is, as you know, I take the Aquaguard Park. And I have taken my Aquaguard Park. Now, I'm going to heal oneself. And we're going to jump like a lunatic into the water. And this is why we take the Aquaguard Park. No radiation. We can breathe underwater. It's brilliant. Now I can fall off bridges in my power armor and not worry, I'm going to suffocate. So where we're heading is here. It's called Spectacle Island. And I'm going to show you the easy way to do Spectacle Island, actually. One second while we're at it. This is how I do it. Okay, normally, you know, people come, you land over there where the building is and you run your way across and stop that. Okay, this is the easy way to do Spectacle Island, <laughs> trust me. Um, I learned this to my cost. We do check out all this wee stuff, but not right now. Um, that over there is Warwick Homestead. We have to go and grab from there as well so we'll do so but we're going to activate this spectacle island is wonderful because of the amount of wood you get this place stops you needing to buy too many wood shipments that and um i actually use it as a little if i do the brotherhood ending and everything um i, I use it as a little getaway for a certain person so he can still see Whoops, up we go. He can still see the Pridwin, but he ain't about to be attacked by it. So, yeah. Um, half tempted to dump him down in Boston Airport and make him a happy little bummer. He loves running around Boston Airport. He will actually turn around and say to you, it's so nice to walk, walk around and, and among my friends. He really does love that airport, like. So, okay, come in this way. Okay, you're aiming for that boat. Run in here. Might be an idea to put your radio on if you haven't got it silenced the way I have mine silenced. Open this hatch. Open this. Open that. And move. Because this is about to happen. You heard it. So then what we do is send that off, heal like a lunatic because as we all know Mate, there's no chance of me down in here. There might be a few like but not me. You should be hearing it sometime soon. There it comes. 
the artillery. Now they don't always get the queen, but they will take out everything that's with the queen for you. As you see, they are damaging the living daylights out of her for you. And bang, she is down. Nope, nearly. There she goes. One queen down. That is how you take the island without having to face down the queen. <laughs> now, up the stairs, we'll actually, we'll do it in a minute. What we're actually going to do is grab the stuff from her because she will actually be disappearing in a minute. As you know, bodies love to disappear. Run like the wind, okay? There are more mere lurk on this island than you can shake a stick at. Run like the wind. Okay, you're heading for this little building here. As you see, they all start to run. Except for the hatchling that seems to be an idiot and is determined to die. You now have Spectacle Island and can use it. And they're a bit angry I killed their mother. So now you can go to the workshop and you can activate yourself Spectacle Island. As you can see, she's all yours. My best advice is these. Do not touch these trees with this wire going across, okay? You need it. They basically stop that. That stops the mirror look from coming back onto your island. Um, if you want the trees, my advice is maybe to put yourself up little power conduits going along but in all honesty I, I I don't touch the trees I just leave it I just leave them be but this is how you get yourself spectacle island and um, as you know she's not actually linked to anything I would advise doing this during the day um, it's a lot of to see I, I actually will clear this place out and then work out that Oh, I missed something. Yeah, I love this game for things like that. So, start in one area and then move across. Now, I don't normally start here where I actually normally start is over there, which is the direction I'm heading in, as you can tell. I'm just trying to clear out. Now, she's not linked to anything at the moment, so... I don't have all my gears and everything for building my stuff. I will go over to the castle and that one person that I had not helped or had not assigned to anything is going to become my provisioner. Although I'll be honest, the castle has got a little bit too big. There's too many people in it at the moment. I'm not happy with that. I never usually let her get that big. I try and keep her to a bare minimum. But I have pulled the plug on her now, so hopefully we can keep her. Now, 99.9% .9 of everything on the island you can scrap. Of course, there is a lot of stuff you cannot scrap. You cannot scrap the house behind you as you come in but there is stuff around that house you can scrap uh, I'm 
Okay, and then go for the roof. Oh yeah, you just cleared it out. Unless you want to keep up, you know, feel free. It's not really anything to keep, but you know. So as you can see, there were some settlers here and they got hit by raiders. Um, the story of the island apparently is it belonged to a billionaire and he built his own private getaway for his family and himself. That's apparently the, what, what the island was. It was like a billionaire's paradise getaway type of thing, you know. Weekend retreat from Boston itself. So, as I say, um, you can get a nice amount of steel. Not loads and loads, but you can get a nice amount of steel. Um, we are heading in the right direction now. I get, I, I, you know what I'm like. I get massively distracted, which is why I don't normally do this when I'm on camera, but. I really don't think a mirror lurk's going to put something into my pocket, mate. Really don't. So, as I had said before, the barrels. Take the barrels, okay? As long as you remove these barrels, you will discover radioactivity disappears and being that I can breathe underwater I can go and do this yes you can empty out the crates makes our lives a little bit easier and a little bit more fun um, there are crates over this way to be looted as well and more barrels I have to take a mother order right away when I'm done here. It's a bit awkward trying to do stuff underwater. It really is, but... And then trying to work out when you're walking out of the... Yeah. Right side. Okay. And now you see why I like that perk so much. So as you can see, there is quite a lot you can actually clear out from the place. That one's locked up. Trust me, I checked before. And then, of course, there's all of this here. Now, there is at the back, for anyone that hasn't gone to the island or hasn't bothered coming over to this bit or whatever, although a lot of people love to do their settlement building, so I know a lot of settlement builders will have already cleared it all out and checked it all out. So, we'll come back to these in a minute. I'll probably deal with them off screen. If you go up here, around here, down here, over here, and down here. <laughs> Could be fun trying to find our way back. There are a lot of safes. Now, you can open them and get the XP, or you can do this and the stuff automatically gets transferred to the, your work back bench for you. My other piece of advice is start at the top and work your way down, because if you grab this one here, it's actually just going to take that entire row away on you, and you will lose out on steel. So my, be oh, my best advice is basically start at the top and work your way down. 